what's going on here? All right, there we go. The chat was glitching for some odd reason. What the hell? All right, it's cool though. It's okay. everything back now. All right, all right. D12, I'm gonna put them in mid. I, nah, what was my cup of tea? De La Soul, definitely good. I wouldn't say goaded, but good. They wasn't my cup of tea. De La Soul had a couple of hits here and there, but they wasn't my cup of tea. Digital Underground, mm, I was gonna throw them in the mid, but I put them in good. I put Digital Underground in the good. In good. Only reason why I can't put them in mid because I'll be disrespecting the fuck out of Tupac. Dog Pound, I'm gonna put Dog Pound in good. I can't put them in goaded tier, even though Daz is a Daz is an underrated producer, bro. That's all I'm gonna say. Daz is an underrated producer. Uh, let's see here. Oh, the Fujis, the Fujis, the Fuji, Fujis, Fujis. Fuji's okay, yeah, good. <laughs> I'm gonna put it in good. I can't put it in good. It wasn't good. Not my cup of tea. They are great. They are great, but they wasn't my cup of tea. I can't put them in good because everybody because everybody loved Lauren Hill. I can't just do it just because of that. Like it's based on what I like, and they wasn't it. But G Unit though, G Unit. I put it in with the gun and I don't care. I'll try to see who is this? Who is it? Is this who I think it is? Wait, who is this? Oh, Ghetto Boys, Ghetto Boys. Oh, Ghetto Boys is definitely goaded. Ghetto Boys is definitely goaded. There will be no Will Smith slander on this channel. DJ Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince is goaded. I don't want to hear it. I don't care if you don't like Will Smith and his PG and his PG thirteen raps. There will be no Will Smith slander over here. You get slapped like Chris Rock. There will be no Will Smith slander over here. Oh man, Junior Mafia. I put him in the good tier. I can't put. It. I can't put Junior Mafia in no goaded tier because nigga Biggie wrote all they fucking raps except for uh, Little Kim. Hell no. Wait, who is this? Who is this? I can't really tell. Who is this? Okay, this is going to be my first never heard of. You listen to brand new funk. I no, I don't. I don't know who that is. Uh, Migos. I'm putting in goaded. Oh, brand new funk by Will Smith. Okay, I thought you was talking about a group. I was about to say a group called Brand New Funk. But yeah, uh, by Will Smith. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you was talking about a group. I was like, who is Brand New Funk? Uh, let's see here. Mob Deep, I'm gonna put them in good. Really wasn't my cup of tea. Plus, they had some hits and misses on. They had some hits and misses on albums, bro. Mob Deep had some hits and misses. Mur Murder Inc. Come on, man. Murder Inc. is goaded, man. Regardless, <laughs> regardless of what, how bad Fifty ended Ja Rule's career. Murder Inc. had. Murder Inc. was a was a fire ass label bro between Ja Rule, Ashanti and then later on they got Lloyd oh my god that was a that was a goaded ass wreck that was a goaded ass group I feel you though but they kind of like they kind of like set their own wave and niggas did follow them though niggas did copy their formula though that's one thing i will say they did have their own style 
which is something that's very rare in today's rap now, is the fact that these niggas had their own style and they did it just like with their own type of pizzazz. That's what made them stand out was because they were so different from everybody else. But I do agree with you. I could put them down here, but I'm gonna leave them up here, just because they did have their own. They they had their own. They had their own. Uh, they had their own lane. And then I don't know who the fuck this is. Yeah, I don't know who the fuck that is. So we just go throw them up in here. Naughty by nature. Naughty by nature. I'm gonna throw them in the good tier. Uh, let's see here. Wait, who is this? Oh, the Neptunes. The Neptunes. I mean, the Neptunes. I mean, they did have that one album, though. They did have that one album, though. The Neptunes, they had that one album in 2002 or 2003. I don't remember. They had that one album where it was like complete bangers all the way through, bro. From start to finish, bro. They had that one album, bro. I'm not going to lie. The Neptunes, I'm going to throw them in good for right now. But like if we talk producer-wise, they go to it. But from an album perspective, I don't know. The Neptunes, I don't know. I'm going to throw them in good. NWA is goaded. We ain't even got to discuss it. NWA is goaded. Uh, oh, Onyx. Onyx. They would have been goaded if they would have made more music. Because they definitely had their own sound. Outcast is goaded. It's not even enough for debate. Once again, who is this? Is this the Outlaws? Outlaws. We'll throw Outlaws in... I don't really know. You know what? I don't know if I could really throw them in the goaded tier because they really, as a group, outlaws as a group though. Unless this wait, is this outlaws or is this um? Let me see. Is this outlaws or is this thug life? If it's thug life, then they goaded. But if it's outlaws, no, nah, that's the outlaws. That's the outlaws. Throw them in the good tier. If it was Thug Life though, Thug Life is golden. <laughs> Them niggas was golden. But um, Outlaws, I'm gonna throw them in a the good tier. They had a good album, but they wasn't fucking with that Thug Life album. Not Thug Life album. Ten out of ten. I don't know who the outsiders are. Let me see. Get a better look at it. Yeah, I don't remember. I don't know the outsiders. No, nah, they they had an album. The the out the outlaws had an album. They had a whole album that they put out in I believe ninety nine. I believe ninety eight, ninety nine. One of them years. That was a pretty good album, but it's just not fucking with Thug Life. Thug Life was way better. Uh, let's see here. Prime Suspects. I don't know who Prime Suspects is. I don't know who Prime Suspects is. Public Enemy is goaded. Run DMC is goaded. If it wasn't for them, a lot of rap acts wouldn't even be here. KSI. I never heard of KSI, his group. And I don't tend to find out about them either. I don't know nothing about KSI, his group. Yeah, that, that album. That album was pretty fire, but it, it still ain't fucking with Outlaws. I'm sorry. I'm, wait, who is this? Is this... I don't, yeah, Public Enemy is goaded. I'm trying to see who this is. I don't know. I, 
remember the face, I just don't remember the name. Y'all gotta help me out with that one. I remember the face, I just don't remember the name. Team 10, never heard of them. Who the fuck is that? The Funky Bunch, the fuck out of here. What is that? The Roots. Oh, man. Hey. Hey, Amir. We might have a, a, a gully boy moment here with the Roots. We might have a gully boy moment here with the Roots because... Uh, I'm throwing them there. <laughs> that shit, I don't like nothing about the roots. I don't like, I don't like nothing about the roots. We might have a gully boy moment here. <laughs> Three Six Mafia is goaded. It's not even up for debate. Houdini, I remember them, but I'm gonna I'm a throw them here. I'm gonna throw them here. Wu Tang is forever goaded. Wu Tang is for the kids. <laughs> I'll throw them down there. Wait, who is this? Oh, Supersonic! Okay, so let me get these all before we get up out of here. I never listened to them. I don't know who they are. The faces are familiar. Is the names not registering? That's the thing. They they face is not red. The, the faces are familiar. The name is not registering. If the face if the name registers, I could I could give them a ranking, but I can't really rank them right now. Ah, uh, let's see here. Supersonic. Uh, supersonic. Supersonic, I'm throwing in the mid. Uh, there was some kids. Crisscross, crisscross. I'm throwing Chris Rock, crisscross in the good tier. They had some fire. Eric B and Rakim is is a. Do we really count this as a group though? I guess because if you're gonna count DJ Jazzy Jeff and Fresh Prince, then I, I guess. Yeah, I I know about Houdini and them, man, but that 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 shit ain't for me, man. They had some hits back in their time, man, but that that they, they ain't for me, man. They ain't for me. And then you got the uh what was that group called again? House of Pain. House of Pain. Why is House of Pain on here? House of Pain, I'm throwing them in the... It's only two places they can go. Cause they don't, cause they only got one hit. They only got one hit. <laughs> and I ain't gonna lie, that shit was kind of a ball. <laughs> we go have a gully boy ball. <laughs> Who's going? We finna have a gully boy moment up in here. Oh man, let me check the score real quick. What's the score? Oh, okay, that's that's another thing. I'm gonna have to throw the uh, House of Pain. Where do I throw these guys so we can end this off so I can go to bed? Jump around. Jump up, jump up, and get down. <laughs> Jump, 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 jump into the trash, nigga. Fuck out of here. <laughs> hear me and hear me good, nigga. I'm here to double down. This shit is a, a two pack of ass. Oh, uh, shit stinks. Oh, uh, man. <laughs> jump up, jump up, and get down. I still can't figure out who they is, though. <laughs> I 
I, I still can't figure out who that is. If I knew who they was, I don't know who they is. If if is that arrest? I I want to say arrested development, but I don't think that's arrested development. I don't think this is arrested development. I'm trying to figure out who this is, bro. I'm trying to figure out who this is, bro. Maybe mm, search with images. On, uh, let's 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 see, bro. Let's see. Who is this? Is this Slum Village for real? Oh, this is Slum Village. That's Slum Village. That don't. They don't look. That's Slum Village for real? That's not, I don't remember them looking like this. I remember there's a dude in the group that looked like an uncle. Nah, this can't be Slum Village. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way this Slum Village, bro. I remember Slum Village vividly. These don't look like the Slum Village dudes. You checking out that Monique Club Shay Shay episode? Tomorrow when I'm at work, I would have checked it out, but I had to uh I had to do something earlier. I had to do something earlier. I had to go get me a um I had to go get me a fucking, uh, what you call that shit? A fucking, uh, pizza oven. Cause I ain't finna have no gas because these motherfuckers done found it. Apparently there was a gas leak. So they shut the whole gas line down for the next four blocks. So that way they can redo the pipes and shit. Cause it was a, it was a, it was a big ass gas leak. I was wondering why outside it smelled like gas. I was like, who the fuck out here fucking around with gas? Turns out it was a gas leak in the ground, so I ain't got no fucking, I ain't got no stove, I ain't got no hot water, but shit, I'm good though, I, I'm good though, I got a, uh, see, you could prepare for this shit, see, when you like me, you could prepare for this shit, so I got my motherfucking air fryer, I got my stove top, I got my motherfucking, uh, my pizza oven, and then for my hot water, my hot water, I got a fucking, uh, what you call them? Like a mini, uh, water heater. They got like these portable mini water heaters. You just hook them up to your, uh, shower, your shower thing. And then you can, uh, then you gotta worry about hot water. The only thing is you can only use that shit for like seven minutes before it cut your power off. Cause that shit use up all your power. So I'm straight. We ain't gonna have no gas for like two weeks till they fix the shit. Because of big ass gas leak. Oh boy. But that's Slum Village, though. That don't look like Slum. Matter of fact, hold on real quick. Because they talk about this is Slum Village. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. That don't look like Slum Village, bro. Unless that's unless there's like two variations of Slum Village, because I don't remember Slum Village. Let me type it in real quick. And this one here is a heat loss, like a beat block. Oh. And this one here is a heat rock shit like a beat rock. The beat rock, new version of Pete Rock. I'm trying to see though, is this actually Slum Village? Cause this is Slum Village right here. And they said this was Slum Village. So I'm trying to see. What's really good? Cause 
Cause I just want to do this one real quick before we get up out of here. Cause I don't believe that slum village, bro. That can't be. I really try to figure out who is this group. Cause if it's not Arrested Development. <laughs> if it's not Arrested Development, then who the fuck is this group? Cause I, they, they don't remind me. Oh my God, this shit taking forever. Really, it's gonna take forever. Let's see some real quick. Okay, here we go. Cause they don't look the same, bro. That's what I'm saying, though. They don't look the same. Hold on. Bro, they do not look the same, bro. Bro, these niggas don't look the same. They don't match up. It's Bob Marley and Gang. Cause they say in this slum village, I'm like, yo, ain't no way. Cause them niggas do not look like. It. Yeah, that's that's that, that definitely can't be slum village. So if that's Bob Marley and gang, I, I guess I, I don't know. I never heard of. Them. I'm gonna just put them. Never heard of. Them. Yep. <laughs> That's going to about do it for this one, man. I appreciate y'all for rocking with me, man. We're going to try to come back tomorrow, man. I got to wake. I got to go to work early in the morning tomorrow because I got to train somebody. Oh, boy. And don't nobody else want to show up early tomorrow. They're like, nah, let him do it. So, all right, cool. I'll do it. But anyways, I'm going to see y'all hopefully tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, I appreciate all y'all rocking with me. We're going to try to finish up the rest of these tier lists I got on here. And I'm going to see y'all next one. Till then, peace out. Bye.